it's awesome whenever you have other people that can come up here and can be their own voice. I don't know what happened to Rebel. I know he wanted to confront Filthy, but it looks like Filthy wasn't about trying to confront anybody anyways. So, Miss Andrea did, and so did Army. And there's a link for them to join again if they want to. Remember, hashtag Gene Team Regime Forever Strong. You guys want to help support the Gene Team Regime? You can be sure to donate to either my Cash App, Miss Chrissy's, or Books, or Mr. Dumb Geniuses. I'm waiting for Miss Chrissy to come back in and oh Rebels here. Hey Rebel. Miss Chrissy, if you want to come back up, we appreciate it. We need to document um what all he said and was alluding to in that live earlier. I know you talked you touched on it a little bit just a while ago, but that's messed up. And you left up out of here, but uh, he, um, I ended up uh, leaving too. And uh, man, who didn't I tell you he was gonna say the K word? You can't bring him up. You can't even have a conversation with these dudes. They're not even fucking damn men, man. I mean, you seen how little me acts. He don't do nothing but fucking argue with you and damn fucking be petty and childish, just like Buddy over there passing out your fucking number, just like little fella painting the generally pink, adding me and damn Gene in there. Meanwhile, damn like Carolina Cowboy over there got me and you damn as Bo and Luke Duke and damn. Man, these motherfuckers, dude, they ain't they 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 ain't, they ain't good old boys, man. No. Yeah, yeah, they hang, yeah, they hang, yeah, they hang yeah. with filthy and Moses Sheeps, man. Don't you see that? Don't you know that? Yeah. yeah. These are people that are always talking shit about them hating on Gene and Ice for them just hanging out. Meanwhile, they'd be triggered and mad calling them gays and faggots and shit. Now all they're doing is doing that to me and you. But they don't yeah. ever do that to Johnny because Johnny sit over there. Damn, and dude, I'm going to tell you, damn, Gene is, is over there, damn, riding the hell out of Johnny's cock. Damn, and, and they're going to say that, uh, like, what, you, uh, I don't know, they I don't know. you I, riding I don't mine, know. and that you in the bed with me riding mine, and that, that uh, you's over there, damn, uh, holding hey. my pocket. Do you hear this shit that they saying about you? Man, I don't care what they say. I don't care what they say about John. You ain't holding my pocket, cause how can you hold a pocket you can't even see? We online. I, you know what I, I mean? I, Meanwhile, I Caroline care. Cowboy said in that chat he want you to hold his pocket. Like, I don't care what the, I don't care what they say about you or Gene or Johnny. Like you know, I'm I'm cool with you. I'm, I'm all right with Johnny and cool with Gene. Who the fuck? Why they be hating on us, though, man? I mean, I, I can understand, man, if they hating on Gene for selling crack to kids. I mean, I never sold crack to kids, man. I can understand hating on Johnny because he's got them 26 records or whatever and them an ex-drug addict yeah, that, or whatever, that, that, and that, live off hey, the government. But, I mean, hey, I don't know. Hey, 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 man, man. Hey, man, hey, man, I can't. Man, please don't talk bad about Gene. I ain't talking bad about him, man. Like you said earlier about April, everybody's got a damn past, man. It is what it is. We ain't going to sit here and pick on them. Fucking damn, fucking, you know, it is what it is. We forgive them. It's over. It don't matter to us. We don't give a damn. I don't know why these people care about these people 
enough and act what the way they do, man. I'm just saying. I just like who's in anybody's business. I just became. You don't give a fuck. Became. I mean, cool about with, this cool. April chick. She come in. Do you see what they're doing to her, man? Yeah, I was just saying that um, I just came cool with Jane again, sort sort of. So I, I'm not trying to like, you know, if you got something to say about like, I don't want to be up here because then they'll, some people will be trying to say, oh, he was up there talking and shit, you know. No, I wasn't. That's another thing. You can't let these people run with lies and narratives out here talking shit. They make up anything and everything and say, man, man, they said I'm a gay racist cop clansman. You believe that shit? I mean, you can't believe that this shit. People don't believe this shit. Yeah. I mean, I get, I get text messages say they really painted General Lee pink with a rainbow flag. Yeah, they did. We ain't getting along with people like that, man. Never in my life will I get along with people like that. Yeah, they so lame and childish, man. You want me to get along with people that give out my number and dog send us the kids, and then meanwhile I got damn thousands of faggots from the LGBT community calling me asking me if I damn how much I charge in a mile uh, like I prostitute. Like, come on, man, and you want me to get down with that and just there? <laughs> yeah, yeah. What do you What do you mean, Miss Jackie? Talking about damn, why can't we all just get along? Oh, no, you fake as fuck. No, I'm talking about what Miss Jackie mean. She oh. said something about... She, said she agrees. They lame and childish. Talking about filthy. And buddy. All of them. And little fella. She, she agrees. They lame. They childish. They petty. They controlled by triggerism. They ain't no good old boys. <laughs> They would have never did know what they did, man. Yeah. Ain't nobody going to tell me, uh, I did it as a joke. The fuck you did, you did because you triggered as a motherfucker. And you ain't no good old boy. <laughs> and you broke a code there, bud. And your little following ought to damn unsub from you from that. I ought to know better and see the difference. See that them, you know, you're lame, you're childish, you're petty. You lost the war, it's over. You folded. Hey, I stayed underground for them about two or three weeks or something. And all of a sudden, when a motherfucker hot, the bitches all on me. Hell, I damn come over here, them, you made me a channel, and these motherfuckers all on me, huh? What up, guys? Oh, you making a video? Okay. that too yeah that damn show boy I don't know them boys got more pussy than them uh oh, damn they boy they had a damn you ever watch that show yeah them boys was always getting laid yeah, they were fighting over damn women it wasn't until them uh, Carolina Cowboy had a vision where damn uh, Bowen Luke was gay and wasn't getting pussy Oh, I don't know, man. Oh, no. They just, they started with that gay shit as soon as I come, being friends, hanging out, giving Square a chance, getting to know him. They damn fuck with you if you just, you know, whoever you associate, hang out with. I personally don't, I don't, I mean, I don't, I don't give a fuck. I don't care. Like now, hell, gay's a new thing, ain't it? 
I mean, Obama come out there and gave them extra set of rights. Now, now it's it's hip to be that or uh, you're square, right? It's old yeah. saying. In that song, if you would, can you find that song? Play me that song. Ship to be square. Ooh, they do it. It's wrong when I do it. No, you might it's not even to... never heard it, Square. Oh, it's you hip to be know. square. Yeah, I've heard yeah, it. Yeah, let me square. hear that. Let me hear that. You know, it's hip to be square. Man, I'm going to tell you. Let me hear that, man, for the one time, for the one time. Taking it back to back to the future with Michael J. Fox, man. Come on. Y'all know who that guy is, right? Hold on. Come on, Huey well, Lewis. That, Huey that Lewis. Was in, that was in, uh, yeah, that was that was in the uh, uh, American Psycho movie. Oh, that too. Right. Yeah, play that song. It's hit to be square. Because obviously, man, you know it's hip, and uh. It's, I guess after fucking hanging out, getting a no square, they they think I'm hip, man. They think square's a rebel, and they think I'm a square. A rebel's a square. Y'all know that shit? Shit, I looked in my notifications, boy. They've been tagging the hell out of me, man. Like I was a celebrity. You know that? Mm hmm Oh, cause it was hip to be square. You know that? No, we don't think people are gonna cash app us. I don't even have a cash app. I don't ask for money. I don't want your fucking money in my cash app. Like I said, I don't even have a cash app. Hey, I'll block you just because of your dumb ass fucking shit. Because you're just, you're petty and childish, and I ain't going to have time to fucking pay you any attention. So goodbye. You are the weakest link. Thank you, because uh, when I took you out, three of you went out and went along with him. So goodbye. You don't even know what the fuck you're talking about. Cash app that. All right, here we go. Hold on. You have to be square. Yeah, he's he's researching it, finding it for y'all. Huey Lewis in the news. Yeah. It's a lot better than naughty news, I'll tell you that. At least Huey Lewis and the news don't damn nod out every time they fucking make the news. And I know, I know y'all wouldn't be making the news these days, nowadays, if you wasn't fucking uh, nodding out, naughty, or so naughty. What up? Here's uh, when he was in America. Man, whoop some heads. I've been taking names. Let's get it. Look. When sports came out in 83, I think they really came into their own, commercially and artistically. The whole album has a clear, crisp sound and a new sheen of consummate professionalism that really gives the songs a big boost. He's been compared to Elvis Costello, but I think Huey has a far more bitter, cynical sense of humor. Hey, Albert Shrimp. Yes, Alan? Why are there copies of the style section on the place? Do you have a dog? Chow or something? <laughs> no, Alan. Is that a raincoat? Yes, it is. In 87, Huey released this for the most accomplished. That to happen. Meanwhile, that's what y'all want to happen.
Do you know that in American Psycho, Willem Dafoe acted each meeting with Patrick in three different styles in three takes. One, as if he knows Patrick is the killer. Two, as if he only suspects Patrick is the killer. And three, as if he doesn't suspect Patrick at all. Director Mary Heron later spliced these clips together to keep viewers guessing. Do you know that in American Psycho, Willem Dafoe acted each meeting with Patrick in three different styles? I guess you could say I just want to have a meaningful relationship with someone special. Hmm. Patrick, Patrick, I know you're there. Pick up the phone, you bad boy. Do you want me to go? Yeah. I don't think I can control myself. I know I should go. I know I have a tendency to get involved with unavailable men. And, I mean, do you want me to go? I think if you stay, something bad will happen. I think I might hurt you. You don't want to get hurt, do you? No. I guess you could say I just want to. He came close, almost killing her. Uh, I got Rebel has gone. What the folks that? No, I'm here, man. I ain't going nowhere. Uh, I'll, I'll tell you, man, just because my mic's somewhere. muted don't mean I went somewhere. They they like to joke and pick and say, "Damn, he's fifteen minutes late on the chat." Like I don't even I don't I don't even read the chat. Like I don't pay no attention to these trolls. I be making a music chill stream and be getting four hundred to seven hundred to six hundred views, and damn, it been doing good. But they and I don't even see why they come in. They be trying to come in and damn ruin and, and listen to music. A lot of them don't even like me listening to music, man. They be acting petty, come in to say the K word. And show show porn bomb when I'm just listening to music. You believe that? Oh, uh, you leaving KC? All right, KC. Talk to you later. See you tomorrow morning. All right, KC. Have a good ha good night. Good afternoon. Team team regime out. Yeah, good filthy the mom. He didn't want the smoke. He didn't want the smoke. Who is that? Naughty down there? Oh hell, Naughty! What are you doing here, Naughty? That's God, Andrea. That's Andrea. Right, down, man. I'm gonna hit the mute. I really was. Hmm. Well. Yeah, I am too. Uh, Rebel, you have a good night, man. You y'all keep the chill stream going, man, for real. If you want, um, I've got to go and uh, get to fixing the dinner and stuff. <sighs> Do stuff with brownie and stuff. I've been on here a lot lately, and I need to take some some time away. But 
look, man, uh, maybe tomorrow uh, we get together or something on here. Or, uh, uh, hell, you never know. I might end up coming back on later if you'll stay on. But, all right. Uh, I guess he's stepped away for a second. Well, hopefully he heard me. All right. All right, Rebel.